BK with Black Ops 2 and this is one of my league play matches from the other day playing on the Mosh Pit series and I'm quite enjoying the league play so far it's quite good uh, it's still on the trial season at the moment but I'm looking forward to when it gets released fully I will be playing that and I'm looking forward to it so uh, we're playing on Standoff which is one of the smaller maps of Black Ops 2 and we're playing Capture the Flag as the game type as well I'm using a Scorpion Evo with C4 a smoke grenade and I'm using UAV, Stealth Chopper, Swarm as well and I'm quite enjoying this class to be honest the Scorpion Evo is a great gun, it's a brilliant submachine gun I've had no problems with it so far it's really accurate, it um, fires really well from the hip as well you know I've, I've had no problems with this class so Scorpion Evo has got to be one of my favourite guns so far um, so we're playing it on Capture the Flag and I actually do quite well in this game considering the map's quite small and I don't do that well on small maps for some reason usually with a small map lots of people die which means that a lot of score streaks are going to come out so when the score streaks start coming out and then you know they're just like firing loads of missiles on you and you can't do anything about it all it is is spawn killing at the end of the day So I do I do quite well, I get some decent captures, um, I make sure that I get the flag a few times, I get some decent kills, I hold on to the flag, I don't rush things, which sometimes, being an objective based player, um, I do sometimes rush onto the objective to try and, to try my best to make sure that I'm doing everything correctly. Um, sometimes with capture the flag I do attempt to just run straight for the flag and just run straight back a lot of the time that does not work so this time it was a made a change if I'm honest to, to actually do something you know well <laughs> for once um, so I get myself a couple of stealth choppers and it must be said I, I am supposed to die a few times in this match a few times when my screen's flashing red and I should have died when I where I didn't um, I do get a few deaths in the end and um, I'm quite impressed with my score at the end as well, especially for a small map, because I, I do so badly on small maps like this. Um, but this is all recorded on the theatre mode as well, which is why there's no kill cam here. Um, that's a big plus about having a Call of Duty, is that you know it records all the matches for you and you don't need to worry about recording things if that's what you wanted to do. So. Um, at this point I'm still chucking C4 in the air. I do quite enjoy using C4. Um, I like the option to to throw to throw an explosive but it doesn't blow up straight away. I like to use it as a booby trap, put it on objectives to make sure that people don't plant bombs or take flags and things like that. So um, I do do quite well, especially for capturing the flag wise because I don't usually do that well on capture the flag. It's not my favourite game type in the world. If it was flag based, um, was flag based even, I would be on domination because I do prefer domination and um, that's one of my best captures right there. It was really lucky that was because they were, they could have drawn level then just to make it 2-2 and uh, especially with a minute to go there's not a lot of time left. So it was a good take by me and it was a good defend as well to return the flag. So I was quite impressed with that one. I love how you can throw C4 so far as well. You used to, you know, say for COF4 for example, you didn't used to get to throw it that far, but it's like a, fris a frisbee. You used to like, pick it up by the side and just fling it at someone's face. It works out really well for me. Um, I end up defending the flag here. I see the guy. I always look out on the UAV or on the map to find out where the flag carrier is. And I always like to get to that flag carry and take him out as quick as possible. The further away the flag is, our flag is from their base, the better it is for me. So there's less pressure. So um, back into the second half. And um, I go straight around the back because what you would expect is someone rushes straight for your flag. But this time that wasn't the case. I was waiting here for a few seconds hoping someone would run past. But no, it didn't happen, which I was quite surprised at. So, 
um, I keep moving forward and I'm looking for their flag. That's what that's what my objective is at the moment to try and get one up on on their team. So I try to get the aerial view, look over, and I do see a guy. God knows how he didn't see me. He puts Betty down. I dodge the Betty and I shoot him poorly, but I shot him. <laughs> Fair enough. He was using a sniper rifle. If he wasn't, I'll probably be dead. Um, this is probably my best flag capture in in this game. Um, usually we'll capture the flag, I would take the flag and try to get the fastest route back to our flag. But this time I waited it out a little bit and I took my time with the flag. And it's quite surprising that I didn't get killed while I was carrying the flag. And I did manage to get it back. Luckily everyone on their team died so they had to respawn somewhere else. But I got the flag back within good time. Dodging a good grenade there as well. And then here's my time to defend our flag. So I get straight back to our base and I'm back on duty again. Failing with the C4 but getting a couple of kills in the process. And then I get electric shoot. I'm dead. <laughs> Easy as that. But I got a stealth chopper at the end of the day. So um one nil up. A couple of minutes left. Usually I find we've captured the flag on on Black Ops 2 is um, the time never gets to run out. The, the objective always gets taken and the match always gets completed by the amount of flags the other team has. So that's that's what I see of it. But I do wait around this time and I decide to wait for the flag to get back to their base, taking their time and I finally got the flag then I run off. And this is just a straight run running as fast as I can. I know that there's no one nearby, just keep trying to run and I get the flag back to the base with a dolphin dive. So uh, that's one of my best matches so far. Um, I was quite impressed with it considering it was a small map and um, especially as it was captured flag as well. I finished with a decent score and that's me. So uh, thanks very much for watching. See you later.